Good morning and welcome to another lesson by yourtechvision.com and today I'm going to go over SharePoint 365. So I have my document already open so I'm going to alt tab to the internet. Alt tab. Alt tab. Alt tab. Nema dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox. Menu. View menu. List view is all selected. Sub menu. One of three. To move through items. Press up or down arrow. Okay so uh, JAWS diligently tells you every single thing in this uh, document. So the first thing I want you to do is control zero. You need to make sure that your internet is at 100% because if you make the pixels too large, uh, you're gonna have that Berlin, that Milner is online. JAWS command issues. So let's go ahead and do control zero. Control zero. Okay, and my page is at 100% because I'm using JAWS. If you're low vision and you want to see it, great, go ahead and control plus, make it larger so you can visually check it out, and then control zero if you want your JAWS to work well. Now, this is all about learning how to control absolutely everything in uh, Office 365, and this is true for Google Drive or anything else in the internet. So I want you to do PC cursor and just, just do it. You don't have to try to move and have JAWS go someplace you don't want it to go. Just hit your PC cursor. Virtual PC. And the first thing I want you to do is insert F5 to see all your options available to you. Leaving menus, Nima dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox, select the form field dialog, list one. Now I'm just going to hush up JAWS and I'm going to tell you what's going on. So visually you're going to see that uh, you're already down uh, a few items because your cursor actually ends up uh, a third of the way down your page to begin with. It doesn't even hit your header. Uh, if you don't know that, then of course you're going to possibly have a sighted person to give you directions and it's going to be even more confusing. But you don't need a sighted person to give you directions. So I'm just going to have you do insert F5 and you can go up and down and see all your options here. What I love about insert F5 is when you hit enter on it, it does not activate uh, whatever it's on. Nor does insert F6, which is your headings links and I'm going to take you there and you're going to see all your links are there but if you hit enter on it it's going to open it in a way you most likely do not want so we were going to we're going to come back here in just a minute escape next menu view menu list view is all selected Insert menu one of leaving menus heading list dialog headings list so here's our uh, headings so you can actually jump to your headings you can use that also if you want to because it will just jump you there and then you can move around hit escape and insert F7. Escape, menu, view, menu, list view, leaving menus, links, list dialog, links, list view, guest contributor, one of ten. Okay, so here are all of your links. So I'm just, let me down arrow. Name column, concise introduction to linguistics. Okay, and visually, if you actually compare these links to your uh, Office 365, this is where they're all at. Uh, if you hit enter on this, the folders are not going to be that big of an issue, but you do not hear enough information in this links list to know what to do. So you can listen to it, that's all fine and, and dandy. Just don't hit enter on it because 365 will decide how to open it and that's where the problems come in. You wanna tell your your programs how to open these. So hit escape and get out. Escape, menu, view, menu, list, view, adults. I wanna go back to insert F5. You can tab, you can tab all the way through here. I don't wanna choose that option. I wanna be more direct. I, I'm very big on controlling my whole page and my JAWS. So insert F5. No form fields. View menu. List view is all selected. Now, if it tells you that, that's no big deal. Hit your PC cursor. Now, if you're in desktop view, you're going to hit your plus on your numpad. If your laptop, it's going to be caps lock semicolon. I'm in desktop mode, so I'm hitting my plus. Virtual PC. And then insert F5 again. Leaving menus. Nemo dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox. Select the form field dialog. List one list view. View menu. List view is all selected. Okay, I can already tell you that is where I want to be. I want to be in the view menu because you're going to see how fast this is to where I want to go. That If you I down arrow to the filters pane, that's not bad either, but I'm going to go uh, right where it actually lands when you open your page. So I'm going to hit enter on that. Enter. Menu. View menu. List view is all selected. Submenu. Okay, so now I'm going to tab and I'm going to get to where all my list items are at. Tab. Leaving menus. Okay. And tab. Concise introduction to linguistics. Folder. Share with others. Modified. Mark. Now, the reason why, and I'm going to shift tab back for a second. Shift tab. Toggle selection for all items. Now, it did not say toggle selection right there. I've been to this page enough times so I know that's what it is. Let's say you're a beginner and it does not give you the feedback you want. The reason why it stops talking when I'm doing this is because the screen capture program that I'm using 
uses a lot of RAM. So one thing I'm going to tell you is close down your other programs. If you know you're working in a program that requires a lot of RAM and you want it to work well, make sure your other programs are closed down. Uh, well, I can't close down my screen capture because of course I'm recording this. So insert tab always forces JAWS to tell you exactly where you are at on your page. Um, insert T tells you in general. So uh, once again, insert tab. It will tell me exactly where I'm at, but I'm going to go ahead and tab into my list view of options. Tab, concise introduction to linguistics folder, share with others, modified, March 30th, row selected. Okay, and it tells you it's selected. It's a folder, so you need to hit enter and open the folder so you can go to all the individual files. So enter. Enter. Concise introduction to linguistics, dash one drive, dash Mozilla Firefox, tab panel, list of folders and files, list of folders and files. I'm just gonna hush JAWS up. So let's go down to PDF from a publisher. PDF from publisher folder shared with others okay. modified. Mar it's a folder and we can go up to Learning Alley in just a second also because I realize you may want to control your audio uh, because what I'm going to show you is going to work on absolutely every single link here. So we're, let's just hit enter on that. Enter. PDF from publisher dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox tab panel list of folders and okay. files. List of I'm just going to hush him up. So the way if you are and anybody who's used Office 365 you already know if you hit enter 365 is going to tell you how you're going to open this. Well, this is how you take control of what you want to open. Let's go ahead and just go Appendix down. C, Appendix C, chapter 01. To PDF. chapter 1. So instead of hitting enter, the way you control it is hit your applications. Page. Applications out of table. Okay, and down arrow and listen. Menu, open up menu, one of three, to move through items, press up or down arrow. So you can control it that way. You can right arrow. Open in browser, one of one. Okay, open in browser. Most people don't want that option. If you hit enter on this, that is what it's going to do. So don't go that way. Leaving menus, list okay. of folders and files, list of folders and files. Use okay, up so I hit left arrow, it closes it, no big deal. Hit your applications key again. Applications. And down to download. Out of table, Me download, two of three. Okay, and hit enter on that. Enter, leaving menus, list of folders and files, list of folders and files. Use up and down arrow keys to navigate. Okay. Now, your options are save. If you're not sure what to do, save it. And then of course you can go to your downloads folder and decide how to open it. But I already have all my options selected correctly, so I'm going to go ahead and either do Alt-O, because I know my Adobe Reader is selected, but I'm going to go ahead and go the long way and up arrow. Open with radio button checked, one of two, to change the selection, press up or down arrow, Alt plus O. If you are not Sally sure Graham. what program it's going to open, tab over and make sure you listen. Tab, combo box horizontal, Adobe Acrobat Reader DC left yeah. parent. So all this is good. It's exactly what I want. So I'm going to hit enter and open it in Adobe Reader. Enter. PDF from publisher dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox tab panel list of folders and files list of folders and files use up and down arrow keys to navigate use the space key to select within the list grid chapter zero one dot PDF PDF file modified September. I'm just going to hush him up. Anyway, I have infer reading open because I want it to infer reading and read this whole document for me beautifully. So all S to save. All S. Chapter 01.pdf dash Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. Read only. Processing page 5 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 17%. Processing page 6 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 21%. Processing page 10 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 35%. Processing page 14 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 50%. Processing page 18 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 64%. Processing page 22 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 78%. Processing page 26 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only. 92%. Processing page 28 of 28. Dot 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 progress R read only 100%. Chapter 01.pdf dash Adobe Acrobat Reader DC. No links. Chapter 01.pdf chapter 1 introduction colon. The nature of communication learning objectives. Black medium square explain the difference in the meaning of the words communication and language. Black medium square record is. And you can already hear it reads beautifully. Oh my gosh. Now let's say you actually wanted to get this into Word. Uh, you can go ahead and go to files. I'm just going to all F. Alt F. Menu bar. File to navigate. Press left. And let's go over your different options. Save control plus S unavailable. Okay. S. Control S, you can save this. Now it said it's unavailable because you're going to need to save as a lot of these documents. So you go down to save as. Save as dot 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 shift plus control plus S. A. Let's say you don't want it in a PDF. Let's say you want it as in text. So down arrow to save as other. Save as other sub menu H. And right arrow. Text dot 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 X. Okay. I'm not going to go through the whole steps because everybody knows how to do save as. You save it as text, it's going to be a TXT and it will literally turn it into text and you can open it in Word and you, then you can manipulate it. Uh, so let's say, you actually have scrolling to, dash Milner is on. let's say you actually have to answer questions and whatnot. Well, that gives you options. You can also use JAWS OCR. Uh, another option which is phenomenal is you can open this, save it, send it to yourself in Google Drive, 
open it in Google Drive, put it through Docs, and it will actually OCR it also. And that's a wonderful option. But if you just need to listen to it, it's right here. I'm going to hit Escape. Escape, again now. escape, menu bar, five. Let's say your infer reading is not set up. You need to get it set up. So Alt E to edit. Alt E, menu, edit menu, undo control. And the easiest way to do this is go ahead and go up arrow to accessibility if you don't know your hotkey yet. Preferences, manage tool, accessibility sub menu, Y. Okay, and right arrow. Change reading options, dot, 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 shift plus control plus five, R. And so it's shift control up five, if you remember that. If you don't, that's just go to your edit and accessibility, hit enter on it. Enter, leaving menus, change reading options of current document dialogue, change reading options of this doc. I'm just going to hush them up. Anyway, this is the box that originally opens. Infer reading, I want to infer the whole document, especially if it's a large document. And uh, go ahead and just Alt-S to start, or tab through your options to start. And it will go ahead and it will infer your reading, and it will read this whole chapter to you, or whatever you have. Escape out. Escape. Add page view. And Alt-F4. Alt-F4. PDF from pub. Okay, let's go ahead and go to Learning Alley. Now, I need to go up. A level. I like backspace. You can alt use alt left arrow also, but I'm just going to hit backspace. Land. Concise introduction to linguistics dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox <laughs> tab panel list of. Okay, so here I am, and of course I'm just stopping Jaws from talking so I can talk. So I want learning alley. So and Jaws would have told me I'm not learning alley. So space bar. Space. Okay. Learning alley folder shared with others modified March 30th. I'm going to hush him up. Let's hit enter and open. Enter. Learning Ally dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox tab panel list of folders and files list of folders and files use up and down arrow keys to navigate use the space key to select within the list grid okay. mp.html dot htm. Now if you hear html it's going to open it in html so let's go through those options to see all the different ways you can deal with this. I could hit spacebar on 10b but let's go ahead and down arrow a few times. 12b dot html 1b dot html html file modified June 10 20. Let's just open 1B HTML and see what it is. Enter Mozilla Firefox read only about colon land. Mozilla Firefox HTTPS colon slash slash football teams dash my dot sharepoint dot com slash personal slash 10 mil. Okay. And you're going to see it's a bunch of garbage. Control F4 on this because it is garbage. Learning Ally dash one drive dash. Okay. And so I can already tell you I, I don't have the Learning Alley app. But if you hit enter on these, uh, the SMIL and the HTML, they're going to open as garbage. So when you download these, you need to go ahead and also make sure you have the Learning Alley app. And so just do a Google uh, search for Learning Alley app, and if you bring up your links, you're going to have every type of download the app you need. And of course, you want to download it from Windows PC, sign in, and then when you hit your Applications key, you can download, and then you will open this link just like all the other uh, options and ways I have shown you with that applications key, download, and then open with. Okay, so let's go ahead and go backspace on this. Land. Concise introduction to linguistics dash one drive dash Mozilla. And let's go back another level. So Land. Nema dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox. Tab panel. List of folders and files. List of. Okay, let's go ahead and go down to Uncle Tom's linguistics, cabin. Religion is the American Uncle dash Tom's dash cabin folder shared with others modified March 20. Enter. Let's enter Uncle dash Tom's dash cabin dash one drive. Okay, once again, you need a Learning Alley app if you're going to be doing this. Let's go down to an audio. Uncle Tom's Cabin Left Parent Audio MP3 Right Parent Folder. Okay, so if I hit enter, it will open it in the internet. It actually works fine, but I'm going to come back. I'm going to show you how to take absolute control of it. So let's enter first. Enter. Uncle Tom's Cabin Left Parent Audio MP3 Right Parent Dash 1. Okay, and let's down arrow to select an Unclip option. Underline zero, two underlines, no underline, enter. Unclip this underline is zero. Box recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, one point four percent. Uncle Tom's cabin left there in audio. Okay, I'm a, I'm a person who wants to take control of this. So applications. Applications key. name column. Unclip them underline zero. My show actions button menu. Now remember, if it says show actions, that means you've lost focus because you know after your applications it should say download. So back up arrow again. Name column. Unclip them underline zero. Nine underline so. Insert Z. Oh, list of folders and files. List of folders and files. Use up and down arrow keys to navigate. Use the space applications. Applications key. Menu. Download. One of two. To move through items. Press up or down. Enter. enter. Leaving menus. List of folders and files. List of folders and files. Okay. Use. Now my default is Windows Media Player. Uh, you can change your default to whatever you want it to be. Mine's Windows Media Player. So I'm going to just hit Enter on Windows Media Player. Enter. Unclip them underline zero two underlines. This is a LibriVox recording. Okay. All LibriVox Control recordings P. are in the public. Pauses it, Control P, plays it. Public domain. For more information or
I'm going to go ahead and close that so that's when you're and you can tell it exactly where you want to go once you download it. Alt F4, Uncle Tom's Cabin, left pair of audio M. Okay, so that's how you hit your MP3s, backspace. Land. Uncle Dash Tom's Dash Cabin, Dash One Drive, Dash Mozilla Firefox, tab. Okay, we've got a text file, so let's go ahead and down arrow. Undefined folder, row selected. Uncle Tom's Cabin, okay. left pair of Daisy. So Daisy, if you know that's what you want in Daisy, and literally you only have to have one option here, and once you do your download, and you've got your programs on your computer, you can tell it exactly how you want it to open. Let's go down to your text. Uncle Tom's, Uncle Tom's, Uncle underline Tom underline S underline cabin dot Okay, you don't want it to open in your browser, so applications key. Applications, feedback. Okay, now you know if you down arrow one time, it should say download, so listen. Feedback. No, it does not, so up arrow. Details, open the details pane menu. Okay, what do we do? We're gonna go ahead and insert Z. Off. Okay, and down arrow. Menu, download, one of two, to move through items, press up or enter, leaving menus, list of folders and files, list of folders and files, use up and down arrow. Now my text files, my default is notepad, you can tab in here. Tab, combo box horizontal, notepad left there. And so we're going to go ahead and enter. Enter, uncle underline, tom underline, s underline, cabin dot txt, txt file, modified, march 29th, row, select windows up arrow. Okay, windows up arrow, maximizes. Okay, and then you can go ahead and insert down arrow, listen. Uncle Tom's cabin area features no contents, cover title, page, copyright, one in which the reader is introduced to a man of humanity, two, the mother, three, the husband, and father, four, an evening in Uncle Tom's cat land. Okay, so uh, text files, those are very easy. So Alt F4. Alt F4, untitled, dash, notepad, edit, type and text. Alt F4, uncle, dash, Tom's, dash, cabin, dash, one, drive, dash, was Okay, and then just to go back, you just hit your backspace. Land, Nemo dash one drive dash Mozilla Firefox, tab panel, list of... Okay, so I think you get the idea. You can go down, if you hear a folder, you must hit enter and open. So Linguistics let's do that. Religion is art form, fold enter. enter. And open. Religion is art form dash one drive dash with space. Okay. Daisy audio folder shared Daisy with others. Daisy audio, modify. you of course are going to hit your applications key, download. If it loses focus, you up arrow again, insert Z to regain focus, down arrow to your download option. Um, and then of course, as soon as you learn those skills, you can actually force it to do absolutely anything that you want to. So that's how you take control of Office 365.